Hey guys, it's Heather from Calva Plan. I'm so excited to get to show you all this book. This is my newest sticker book. It releases on Friday, October 1st, 10 o'clock a.m. Central, CalvaPlan.com. It's called Weekly Florals. I know that may seem like a weird name, like what does weekly florals mean? But basically this is a book that has kits, like weekly planner kits to help you decorate your planner. There's honestly enough stickers in each kit to do two or three spreads, but there's everything you can need in, in here to do at least one spread, probably more than that. So let's go ahead and get started. Let's see what's inside. Let me zoom out this camera just a little bit so you can see the whole page. So this is our first set. This is a brown. It might look black on the screen, but this is brown. I love these florals. We've got different shades of pinks and yellows and greens. And this is almost like a gold. I think this is so pretty because you can use this in the spring if you're playing off the pinks and the yellows, but the browns would be really cute in the fall as well. So I just, I love this set. And then it comes with a set of colorful boxes and checklists and dot stickers, um, which is, of course, super functional, and the colors coordinate with the kit. Um, sorry, my dog was barking. Anyway, then you get four washi strips that coordinate with the set. You get the days of the week stickers, and then you get some different word stickers that you might use in a weekly spread. So, like, these say this week's focus, this says this week I want to, highlight of the week, today's top three, and weekly habit trackers. And then you get a page of clear florals that coordinates with the set as well. Some of them are smaller and then some of them are bigger. So that is our first set. This is the set that coordinates with the cover of the book. This is the set I used in my classic spread this week. If you missed it, the plan with me was posted on Sunday. And then of course it matches the cover. Um, but I love the reds and the teals. I think they're so pretty. And then we've got some pinks in there too. So these are your decorative boxes. And then you have your colorful boxes that that coordinate and then we have the same these are going to be the same in every kit but they're just different colors to match the kit and then your four washi strips that also match the kit okay and then your clear stickers super cute our next kit this is the one i used in my mini spread yesterday so if you missed that plane with me you can head over there and watch that one um, but this is like a dark blue. Again, it might look black on your screen, but it's actually a navy. And different shades of pinks and different shades of teals. Really, really pretty. I love this set. I think the florals are so cute. Then you have your colorful boxes and checklist and dot stickers that coordinate. Then you have all of your word stickers again over here with your four washi strips. I think these are so pretty. Of course, these are not made of washi, so when I call them a washi strip, I don't want you to think that this is washi material. It's a paper sticker material, but they're cut um, in like a long rectangle so that you could use it as a washi strip. And then these are your clear florals for this kit. I just think they're so pretty, this floral. Just, I just love it. I love this set. This, these graphics here, I've used these graphics before um, on my website for I, I had like a tumbler and a pin bag and a tote bag and it was called stripes and florals but I had never used the graphics in a sticker book so I thought it would be fun to use them as, in a sticker book I think these are really cute for spring we've got some bright colors of course you can use them now you don't have to save them for spring but I love of course I love the yellows but I, this is like a light green and a really pretty teal I just love these colors and like look how beautiful this page is I just think this is so pretty with all of these different colors in the basic stickers and then we have our words and our four washi strips over here again I like the yellow just makes me so happy the pops of yellow in those and then here are your clear stickers most of the clear florals you'll notice there's a big floral sticker on the top two corners on the bottom and then some um, bouquets in the middle that's pretty common it's not it's not necessarily the rule for every kit but in most of these kits you'll see that this is a black and white kit with some gray mixed in. So if you're someone who just loves, maybe some weeks you just want a neutral spread, this is going to be really cute for that because it's got the black and the white and the gray, but with different floral patterns. And then here we have black and gray boxes, which of course is so functional and neutral. You could use this in like any planner spread. Here we have all of the words are in black or gray. And then we have the black and gray washi strips. I especially love this stripe one that I snuck in there. And then see like here, these are just bouquets. This one doesn't have the big one in the corner ones, but I wanted it to be a little bit different. So I really like that as well. 
This is another one of my favorites. I love these florals. This is again a navy background and then we've got the pinks and the greens and the peaches. Really, really cute. Here we have our colorful boxes that coordinate with those. We have our words and our washi strips. And then we have our big floral stickers. So this has two big corner ones and then some smaller bouquets here. This is probably my favorite kit in the whole book. I think this one is just so pretty. The florals are stunning, the colors are stunning. I think these would be really pretty on like a blackout spread because the black is just gonna make the colors pop even more. But I love the turquoise and the pink and the yellow and the orange and the purple. I just, I just love this set. This is probably my favorite set in the whole book. And then we have the really bright, colorful boxes. Then we have our day of the week stickers and all the other weekly stickers over here. We have our four washi strips, which are like, they're stunning. They're so pretty. This kit alone is like my, it's just my favorite in the whole book. And then these are the clear floral. So we have a big corner floral, a big top or bottom floral. And then we have this gorgeous bundle here and then a little one and then a circle wreath. And then the last two pages, this is something that I feel like everybody wants is more weekly stickers. So I did this because there's plenty of stickers in these where you could use these in more than one planner spread. Like you're not gonna use all of these more than likely in one spread. You could probably use them in two or three, but there's only one word set in each kit. So if you wanted more word sets or if you needed them just for a different spread, I wanted to make sure you had them in like all the colors. So we have red, orange, yellow, black, blue, and purple. And then we have black, black, black. So lots of black, pink, purple, and green. So I just wanted to be sure that you had these in lots of different colors. This, this actually is gray. Now that I look at it, this is black. This is, it's close to black, but it's actually gray. So anyway, you get two pages of more word days of the week in case you need more days of the week stickers. So that is weekly florals, um, 30 pages, really cute. One of my favorite books. I think it's going to make, um, decorating your planner like so fast and easy because it's split up into those different kits. I really love this book. I hope you do too. I'd love to hear your thoughts in the comments. Remember it releases on Friday, October 1st at 10 o'clock AM central on calvaplan.com. If you like this book, or if you like this video, I hope you hit the like button. If you want to see more of my videos, hit the subscribe button. And happy planning!